The sparring footage came out. I mean, I know that you spoke on it. I mean, it's from years ago. You were probably, what, like still a teenager or something like that? Um, I was 16. Wow. And it was like, um, the first time I went to 132 was uh, in 2000. 2013, mm-hmm. the end of 2013. Mm-hmm. That sparring was 2014, early 2014. Okay. So I was just going up to 132 at the time. Dude, I was sparring. Um, he was fighting at 152. Yeah, he looked bigger. He no, looked... absolutely. Mm-hmm. But I was so much smaller. My frame, everything, so much smaller. Anyways, it was the first round. Uh, no excuses. I got... It was a flash knockdown. Straight mm-hmm. up. Mm-hmm. Boom. I came in, whatever. I don't even fight. You know what's crazy, though? I got to I gotta say, like, we've come a long way because I don't even have that same style no more. Mm-hmm. Like, so much is... Uh, we just gotten better. But anyways, so flash knockdown, everything. I got back up. Literally got back up. Didn't wobble anything. Why we kept sparring is because I was okay. Mm-hmm. I got back up. Like, oh, shit. Okay, you got me when I, when I was coming in. All right, cool. Mm-hmm. Get back up. And we did two more rounds after that. Dude got so mad that he couldn't do it again. Mm-hmm. And, and I was just saying, you ain't doing shit. And I went back to beat the shit out of him. Sorry for my language, but <laughs> beat the shit out of him. And and at the end, he goes and like somersaults my ass. Right. And slams me. And mm-hmm. slams me. So, you know, um, they posted it. They And a lot of people think... A lot of people think that uh, that was just recent, right? You know what I mean, right? I was wearing I was wearing TMT shit and all that. <laughs> That's right. That's right. I was wearing, I was wearing TMT shit. I was wearing those. Uh, I hate hyper KOs. Honestly, I hate hyper KOs. <laughs> so I was wearing hyper KOs, all those things. Mm-hmm. So that's a throwback, my man. It's a throwback, way back. And um, yeah, why po- why it. post it now though? Is he just is he just is he cloud chasing? Cloud. Yeah. Cloud, like everybody else would. Wow. You know, uh, they even posted, they even posted like the sparring with me and Keyshawn Davis. Mm-hmm. Supposedly they had footage of it. They posted they were that. Recording it. They mm-hmm. posted it, right? But I mean, if you're gonna do a highlight clip on me, mm-hmm. at least make it look good. At least make it seem like you're throwing like thirty combinations or whatever, <laughs> and I'm not throwing any. There's literally him just throwing jabs and moving side, of, moving around. <laughs> And wow. people are like, damn, he gave you that word. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's just, these guys are using anything at this point. And that's mm-hmm. why I told my father it's not a good idea because I already know what these guys are trying to do. Right. They're trying anything and everything to go hard, but they're going to get upset because it's not going their way, one. Mm-hmm. and But two, they're going to use our name because we're that, we're that up in that pedigree right now. We're up there mm-hmm. that, that they'll do anything to get clout. You know, get that that notification, get that like, oh shit, nor notoriety, yeah. mm-hmm. whatever. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And it's just all those things. So it's you know, but it's a good thing. Mm-hmm. It's a good thing. You mm-hmm. know, it's good to it's good to know that people think that you know something that happened six years ago. You know, because I'm about to be 22, mm-hmm. so we're talking about like six years ago. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know that they can still talk about it, and you know, and but look. At the end of the day, you guys want to talk about me getting knocked down and this and that. But if you look about look at sparring with Floyd Mayweather, you know, also uh, Andre Ward, also uh, Manny Pacquiao, all these guys have been knocked down in sparring, have been dropped, except Floyd, you know what I mean? But, you know, they've been knocked down in sparring and everything or dropped in a fight mm. other than Floyd. And look where they're at. You know, these guys are, you know, if not, you know, they are going to be future Hall of Famers. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It's it's boxing. It happens. Right. You know what I mean? Has it happened ever since? Absolutely not. Mm. Mm. You live and you learn. You learn those lessons. You know what you got to do. You don't not to come in on certain things if you're not sure about it. Mm-hmm. If you look at the video, when I was throwing my jabs, I used to run away from my jabs. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I was, I never trusted my jab. Now I'm committed to my drive. A little bit I'm different now. To my jab, yeah. and it's a lot different. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. just a lot of things, man. And from from 16 to 21, about to be 22. Those six years, I've grown a lot. 
But how do you how do you deal with moments like that? How like how do you like shut that out and 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 don't let that negativity influence you and and take you down the wrong path? Um, how is you gotta you, there's always a a bright side to these things, mm -hmm. and you know they, it is a known true fact. There's no such thing as bad publicity <laughs> when it comes to those things. Mm -hmm. Why is because at the end of the day, I just got. I just gained like a thousand more followers because of that. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. For a video that they posted when I was 16 years old, right. I, I was already, look, I already knew that that video would probably air out one day, <laughs> you know? So right. it, it didn't surprise me, mm -hmm. you know? And um, he's actually signed to the same manager uh, as me, you know? Really? David McWhorter, yeah. But you see what I mean? Like, That's who kinda, knows this? Right. But who knows this kid? Right, right. Nobody nobody knows this kid. You right. know? But it's a good thing that they, it just shows where, we, where we're where at. That you have to, you're 14 and old, whatever it is, right? Mm -hmm. Nobody knows you. And the only way you're going to get known is by using my name. Yeah. Shit, I'm doing something fucking good. <laughs> so, yo, hey man, if you could gain, if you could gain a couple followers from that, hey, yeah. congratulations. Mm. But you're never gonna be at, at the top level that I'm at. Yeah. yeah, you know, um, and that's just, and that's the honest truth. And I wish, you know, I called my manager and I was like, hey, I was like, you know, that I was, I was like, you know, that little, that little boy over there, you know, he posted the video. I was like. What way he fight at again? Wait, wait, what he fight at now? He was like forty seven. I was like, fuck. I was like, cause I would have loved to. I would, I would have loved to, um, you know, get it back. Well, you never know. I already got it back. Well, you, know you never I mean? know. You never know. He might, you know, he might work himself up. Might work himself nah, up. No. Nah, fuck, fuck that. I'm, I'm. One thing about me, man, I ain't gonna sugarcoat shit. And mm. one thing is that I am. I'm always going to destroy these guys' dreams. Mm. Mm. Everybody. Mm. I'm going to destroy all these guys' dreams. Everybody. Damn. Now, you dreaming big and you dreaming all this, I'm going to destroy it. Mm. And that's what, what I do when you put them in front of me. Put them in front of me, I'm not only just going to beat you, but I'm going to destroy your dreams. Damn. Damn. Yeah, I'm 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 a cruel motherfucker when it comes to boxing. I was about to say, damn dog, that's I mean you can't just I mean you gotta fuck their dreams up too, man. You can't just take the win. You gotta you gotta take their dreams too. That's fucked up. <laughs> that's what's up though. You know why though, Ben? Hmm. Cause they would do it to me. That's true. That's true. They it's, wouldn't just win, they would just crush my dreams. It's a cold game. That's true. It's a cold game. So to all the fans, man, y'all get butthurt by what I just said. It's the honest truth, man. And that goes for anything. Mm. It goes for anything, man. Yo, and hey, man, you know, how you think about it, man, it's just, you just, how you stay positive is honestly just thinking about all the other things that, that, that are going to happen. The bigger picture? You know, the bigger picture. You look at the bigger picture, mm. you know, mm. uh, you got one fight before you fight for the world title. Mm -hmm. One more fight, then you fight for the world title. You know what I mean? So mm -hmm. it's just those things. You know, you're, this is your main event. You know, mm -hmm. this is your first main event. Um, you know, you got ESPN to back you up. Mm -hmm. You know, all these things. And you just know that as long as you keep on winning everything, mm -hmm. you're going to make it to, you know, they already got me as like stardom. And I'm not even there yet. You That's know, like, <laughs> and I, but, but that is all from hard work. Mm-hmm. You know, a lot of people said that I got it given. Ben, I could take I could take all you guys back to back to ground one of everything. Mm. Mm. Uh, but we're not gonna do that. <laughs> even even when I'm just telling y'all this though, even when I earned everything, they still found a way because they didn't like my father mm -hmm. or anything. They still found a way to screw us. Mm. Mm. Why am I getting these things now? Because it's God is planning all this. One, mm -hmm. two. I'm knocking everybody up. <laughs> That's it. One and two. It's simple. It's a simple plan. <laughs> and then three. Uh, I back it up. That's what's up. <laughs> That's what's up. That's what's up. You know, uh, I grew up my hair now. You know, it's crazy. Mm -hmm. You gonna you keep know, it out? I, you gonna keep it out? Or you gonna shave it before the fight? 
Nah, the wife loves the hair. Uh oh. She uh, so I grew up my hair. You know, like I just I let it grow. I just let it grow. You know, because mm -hmm. I'm just focusing camp and everything. No yeah. cutting the hair. Like forget it. Mm -hmm. Where am I really gonna go? I don't. I don't care about it. You know, focus on camp. Mm -hmm. And you know, my wife is here. And she's like, wait. And I'm like, you know, I'm a cutting. You know, I'm going to Richard Comey's fight and everything for the Beltron and everything. And you know, um, I'm about to cut it. You know, mm -hmm. and she's like, wait, babe, before before you cut your hair, uh, try this look. And I was like. All right, but I'm trying it because, you know, I'm doing it for you. Just then, you know, she's like, I know. I was like, all right. But if I don't like it, you know, she was like, and if you don't like it, you can cut it. You know, go yeah. back to your shit. Yeah. You know, how, and how she met me. Right, right. I get uh, it. Cause I I've, I've had that haircut for 21 years. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> nah, trust me. I get it. Happy wife, happy life. So that's so what she I wants. I did it. I, you know, I did it and. Honestly, she loved it. Mm -hmm. And I was like, all right, so that's all that matters. And then when I went to the fights, everybody loved it. You know, uh, mm -hmm. Christina Poncho was like, oh, my gosh, you look you look older now. You do. I like the hair. That's what I was going to say. Like you hair. look older. <laughs> I like the hair. Keep it. Right, and right. on and on, on and on. Bob Aram loved it. Uh, everybody was just Carmo Reddy, Harrison, mm -hmm. you know. And, you know, all those guys, they they, they loved the hair. Yeah. So. But yeah. right now it's all messy. But once I put, once I get a hair, like I blend it again and and put gel and all that stuff, Be I'm putting gel in my hair now. <laughs> you hear that shit? It's crazy, man. <laughs> Got to stay fresh, fly, and flashy at all times. I get it. I get it. Yeah, That's what's uh, up. For everybody, tune in, man. Uh, July 19th at the MGM National Harbor. Uh, it's on Ticketmaster if you guys can make it yep. in D.C. Um just put top rank boxing and it'll be on there. Um, Ticketmaster.com. Uh, but if you cannot be there, it'll be on ESPN Plus app. Download the app now. Mm -hmm. uh, 10 p.m. Eastern Time, 7 p.m. Pacific Time. That's it'll be on there, man. Teofimo's first main event. Mm -hmm. Hey, the takeover continues.